Hey everyone, I am well aware that there is some kind of big sale going over at some retailer that we're all talking about, but there are other things going on in life and there are other favorites to be found. And today we are going to look back at June, 2021, and we're gonna talk about what your favorites were from last month. Funnily enough, right now, obviously it's Nordstrom sale, but last month, the big, big sale was Amazon Prime Days. And there is a lot of Amazon in today's video for good reason. Lots of great finds, many favorites, obviously of yours. So I'm gonna go through just the overall top 10, then break out the top five in beauty, accessories, and lifestyle. We are also joined by Rowdy the Wine Runner, who is under the table making odd groaning and grumbling noises because he's not getting full attention. So if you see the camera move, or hear any squeaks or sounds, that's what's happening right at my feet. All right, let's jump into the top 10. These are the true top 10 in no particular order and also no particular category. Number one are the pants that I love so much. I have them in four colors and I've been calling them the wrong name. They are the, I wanna read this right, Pret-a-Porter pants, so ready to wear pants. I was calling them the petty pant. The idea behind them is they do have a cuff that you can snap, so if you want to roll them up for, say, a pedicure, they are great for that. They are so soft, they are so easy to wear. They come in so many great colors, from brights and prints, a few solids, and of course, neutrals. They also have a lot of good fit options, so they come in three lengths, short, regular and tall. They also come in petite and classic fit. So I am wearing them in the classic size four for reference. Next is something out of the lifestyle category. And I have heard such great feedback from all of you on this. This is from the Trusted Lab, and this is their extra strength night gummies with melatonin. Now I've talked about this a lot, but just to recap, these do come in two strengths. And when I first started taking these every night, I took them in the regular strength and they were great. When I placed my reorder, I didn't realize I was reordering them in the extra strength. And now that I have the extra strength, I wouldn't go back to the regular. The regular ones are fabulous. Obviously, I thought they were good enough to reorder. They help me fall asleep a little more quickly and stay asleep, which is great. But these knock me out within 15 minutes. It's not like a sleeping pill. You can wake up, but it is a much more rapid descent into full-on sleep. And Michael loves them as much as I do. So we order two bottles a month because we each take one every night and there are 30 gummies in here. Remember, if you're ordering anything from the Trusted Lab, use my discount code, which is just my name, Marnie, M-A-R-N-I-E, and that gets you 10% off site-wide, even on sale items. And if you've been using these, please let me know how you like them. I hope you're enjoying them as much as I am. Next are these wide leg linen pants. They were a favorite last year. They continue to be a favorite this year. They do sell out quickly. So right now I have no idea what the inventory looks like. Go ahead and click that link, which is an affiliate link, if you're interested in finding out what is available in your size and the pattern of your choosing. This year I purchased two more pants, one in a solid chambray and one in a white with a very, almost like a sand washed or distressed black. They're not distressed, but it's very, it's not a true deep black kind of pinstripe. I love them, I wear them on repeat, and it looks like they are favorites of yours as well. Next, number four is this top. This is from the brand CC, which is really more known for their more dressy blouses. So when I saw this, I was really excited because it has the same kind of cut as the CC brand blouses, but because it's a cottony material, it's a little more relaxed and a little more forgiving. I do find the traditional CC dressier blouses to run a little smaller, especially across the chest. So my advice in the other CC blouses, many of which are currently in the Nordstrom anniversary sale, size up if you're not sure, but on this cotton one, get your true size. I'm wearing this in a size small. This top is on limited size availability because it is, I think, half off at this point, but I just found out that it comes in same shirt, but just solids, a bright white and a really bright, almost neon fuchsia pink. Um, and that is still full price and fully stocked if you like this pattern. I don't do anything special to mine. I throw it in the washing machine. I throw it in the dryer on low, no problems whatsoever. Number five is something from Amazon. It is the Amazon Essentials shirt dress. And I was really excited to see this offered in such a fun, bright pop of color. There are lots of options. I love this line. It is very dependable. It runs true to size 
And once you know what size you are in that brand, you can confidently order across the line. The material is so soft. I love that it is a truly functional shirt dress, meaning the buttons unbutton all the way down. So if you wanna show a little bit more cleavage, a little bit less, show a little bit leg, show a lot of leg, and all of the things in between, it's done. I like the drawstring so you can adjust it to fit you just right. I like that you can unbutton the whole thing and wear it as a duster, or you can throw a cardigan or a blazer on top of it. It's just a really versatile piece. It's a great price point, and there are a lot of options in the colors and patterns as well. Another very, I'd say, closet staple piece, but a very different price point is the sandwashed silk blouse. I loved it so much, I bought it twice, one in navy and one in this beautiful teal. They are currently, I think, not quite half off. They're deep discount. So if you want to grab them, now is the time. The bright teal is the only real true bright color. The rest of them are all very neutral, office-friendly colors. White, navy, black, cream, white, that kind of thing. I said white twice. White's a good thing to have. Anyway, what I love about them is the silky softness, but you don't need to dry clean them. They are machine washer friendly and I am wearing those in a size small. I hesitate to even mention this because it's sold out in so many of the colors and sizes. I wanted to order another pair of these denim shorts from Time and True in white, but they are all sold out in my size. I am signed up for the InStock email alerts, which really work. I'm gonna show you something that I got because of one of those alerts. So if you didn't know on the Walmart website, if there's something you really love and it's sold out in the size or color that you want, do sign up for those email alerts. They do actually do them. I know some retailers, you sign up and you never hear from them. I don't know if it, they do nothing or if they really just don't restock, but Walmart really does. And you, you could get that email two years from now, but you're gonna get that email. Luckily, I just got mine within about a week of signing up. But anyway, back to the denim shorts. They are just everything I was looking for, just the right length, the inseam length. I don't like a really short inseam. I don't want it to feel like I am wearing a thong in public, you know what I mean. Um, as with all shorts, but especially denim shorts, size up, sorry, I just bumped the table, size up one so that they will fit very comfortably and you won't feel squeezed in them because that is the worst feeling, especially when it's hot enough to wear shorts, the last thing you wanna do is feel squeezed. Next is this linen cap sleeve dress. It's so pretty. It's such a perfect summer everyday dress. We still have a lot of summer left. It's a great price point. I believe it comes in three colors in this linen combination. I'm wearing it, you know what, I can't remember what size I'm wearing it in. I'll have that down in the description box. I'm pretty sure it's the size small because that's the smallest size that they have. So it runs true to size and it has pockets. Have I mentioned it has pockets? I still, I think it should be a federal law that all dresses should be offered with pockets. But anyway, this is such a great piece. You can wear it very casually. You can dress it up for a daytime event. I love, love linen dresses in the summer. Number nine is one of the most requested links that I have gotten on Instagram in the last month. And these are the square aviators from Amazon. I'm gonna look not directly at camera because there's some glare looking right into the window. They do come in other colors besides this one. I can't even remember what this gradient is called. I just placed an order for a second pair. They actually should be here tomorrow. Same color frames, but I think the lenses are more pink. I love these. One of the reasons I chose these other than the shape was I wanted a pair of sunglasses that didn't have a really dark lens. So I could still wear them on cloudy days. I could wear them walking into a store and keep them on without seeming pretentious because you can see my face. Anyway, I love these and apparently a lot of you love these as well. I should have ranked these number one because that's pretty much where they came on the top 10. And then to round out the top 10 overall favorites was this ruffles cap sleeve dotted blouse, again from Amazon. I think it's been a favorite two months in a row if I remember correctly. Comes in so many colors. It also comes in a long sleeve version that I just grabbed. I can't remember in which order all my videos are going up this month because of a lot of pre-filming around the anniversary sale. So you've either already seen my Amazon haul where you saw the long sleeve version or you are about to. So if you wanna see that, make sure you are subscribed. It's a great top. It's really flattering. I love the very, very slight little ruffled mock neck, the way it flows, it's tunic length, so you can wear it over skinny jeans or leggings, but it's also easily tucked in as well. It's a really versatile piece, and I'm so glad you're enjoying it as much as I am. Let's break out into individual categories, starting with beauty. I used these today. I actually used this one. I had to go hunting for these before I filmed the video because my family members are borrowing them as well. These are facial massagers. Oh, they're so cold right now, it feels so nice. That also vibrate here. 
right? So cool. Anyway, the humidity here is out of control. It's 95% humidity, which is extremely high for San Antonio. We're sort of semi-arid, not desert, but it's usually much drier than that. And this constant humidity and the constant barometric pressure rising, falling, rising, falling has wreaked havoc on my migraines, my sinuses. So this morning I used this one. I'm going to do it again. And I just, I have a horrible headache. It's better now, but, and I just keep rubbing it here. It feels so good when you have any kind of sinus headache. I've been rubbing it here. Okay. I might just have to stop the camera and do this for a little bit. This feels so nice. I'm kidding. Anyway, this is great for all kinds of things. It's also great if, when you do your skincare, if you want to rub it in using this, you can massage it in that way. It's just an extra, it's just extra. It's such a great thing. I like this one for the eye creams personally. This ball just does wonders. Two for one, great price. You gotta grab these. They're, they are, I don't know what I did without them. Number two for beauty is what's on my lips, kind of. I do have lip liner on and I did kind of lightly fill in my lips. But on top of that is what we're talking about. And this is the Maybelline Hyaluronic Lifter Gloss. Last year they released 10 shades. They released another five shades. This year, this is number 12, one of the newer ones in Opal. It's a very nude, soft pink with a little bit of shimmer in it. Great to top over anything, easily worn alone as well. Number three, I could actually stand to use this right now. I learned about this because of the makeup artist who did my makeup for the Gigi New York photo shoot. I love SGX NYC. I've talked about the beach waver spray um, that I just, it's fantastic if you just want the beachy look, but this takes that plus more. It's called the Do It All. It's a three-in-one dry texture spray. So it combines dry shampoo, hairspray, and texturizer all in one. You shake it up. Oh, and it smells like the beach. It smells so good. Anyway, this is really, really good. I will link the best place to get it right now because retailers seem to fluctuate with this as do the prices. So I will link your best option down in the description box. Next, and I'm sure by now you've noticed that my face is darker than my body, but I really wanted to wear this foundation and I really need to do some self tanning today. This foundation has just shocked me at how good it is. And it is the Woma by Sharon C Foundation. Walmart exclusive. It's the flawless in real life skin perfecting foundation infused with green coffee extract. And I am wearing it in the shade T5 Fair Lady. So it's a little darker than my normal skin tone. I'd probably be a T3. Um, but when I bought it, I wanted to match my summer fake tan. Currently not matching, but this foundation applies like a dream, covers beautifully, is very lightweight and feel. I feel like I have nothing on my face. Definitely buildable. And I think you can see is more of a not full matte, semi-matte finish, so really skin-like. I mean, skin should not be shiny. So I'd say it's a very natural, somewhat mattified effect. I have very dry skin. This does not dry my skin out. If you have not tried this, it is worth ordering online from Walmart to get it. It is fabulous. And I will definitely be ordering my regular shade in this so I can always reach for it. And then the last beauty item is something I've got a lot of requests to do a tutorial with. So I might do that over on Instagram later this week, or at some point may have already happened. I'll let you know if it did, I'll save it as an IGTV and put it in the description box. This is the Too Faced Born This Way, the natural nudes palette. I'm embarrassed to tell you that I've had this almost a year, stuck it in a drawer and forgot about it. These colors are so pretty. You can do a brown eye, you can do a little bit of a pink or mauve eye, so you can stay neutral or go a little bit more warm tone pinky. It really just depends on what you feel like. This is the easiest palette to slap on and you cannot mess it up. So I will show this to you in an Instagram live soon. Moving on to accessories. We've talked about these and I did mention I just ordered another one. I can't wait to get those in the pink. The next are these sandals. These are from Mark Fisher. They have a name. I keep calling them my chain block heel sandals. I don't know what the formal name of these are. They do come in black as well as this bone color. I love this big chunky chain detail and I was so excited to see when the Nordstrom catalog came out or whatever that little preview paper brochure was um, that they are carrying that. I've seen on the Steve Madden loafer, we'll talk about that in a minute. Again, it's not unusual to see chain detail across the, what is this, top of the shoe, but 
in such a large chunky chain and in silver, very unusual, which is what I really like about the shoe. I like it has the little cork detail here and on the heel, but it doesn't go all the way through the shoe. It has a normal leather upper there. So love this. So happy to see that you love it as much as me. Now, normally I would not accessorize this outfit necessarily with these necklaces, but these are number three in accessories. These are the Bennett tennis necklaces. I have to, I keep meaning to order another one or ideally I would like to find a gold chain, like a simple gold chain to wear in between these two to kind of break it up. I do want to point out that I have something similar happening on my wrist. It's hard for the camera to focus on this because it's so shiny, but I have the Bennett tennis bracelets and I have the same color combination. I have the multicolor here and the clear crystal on the top and then in between I just have a very simple elastic gold beaded bracelet. So I think I'm gonna just have to order the matching version of this little gold bead bracelet to break it up in between here. So these are not on the favorites right now, but I just wanted you to see how I would wear the necklaces if I had all the accessories that I need to do this look. Number four in accessories are these quilted slides from Time and True. And I had mentioned signing up for the in-stock alert. So I originally purchased these as soon as I got them in the mail. I went to order the other option, which is in white, and they were sold out, signed up for the email alert. And since then, they came back in stock. So I have them in white and I have them in black. I love them both. I love every I love that they're an espadrille. They have the rubber soles and then the leather uppers, insole. So they're not, you know, the espadrille where you put your feet on the soles. Um, the quilted part looks so much more expensive than it is. I think these are $15. I mean, this is such a great steal. And like all time and true shoes, the memory foam insoles. Oh, these are so great. And then last for accessories, this shoe again popped up in favorites. This is from Time and True. There's still some limited sizes available, which is why I'm even mentioning it. I hate mentioning favorites that are no longer available. I think it frustrates everybody. I think what we all liked about it was the gold chain and then the kind of slightly different color. Now, it's, like I said, limited sizes available. The Nordstrom Anniversary Sale has the Steve Madden ones with a much chunkier gold tone hardware across and everything I've seen is in suede or tweed. So it's similar, but really not. But at least it's the pointed toe, which I think is really important. But if you can find these in your size at Walmart, grab these. They're a way better deal and they're very unique. And I hope, hope, hope that Walmart restocks them. Last category is lifestyle. I mentioned far and away the number one was from the Trusted Lab the extra strength nighttime gummies. I was gonna recommend something else. I'll save it for my own personal favorites in July. So these way high at the top of lifestyle. Secondly though, was this guy. This is, I mean, you can use it for anything. It comes in different sizes. I've talked about it before. I have mine filled with a homemade air freshener. It's almost like an aerosol, but it's, it's a trigger. It's amazing. And I've had a few questions. This is not my own recipe, but the proportions are one part fabric softener to three parts water. If you wanna make your own concoction. I'll have to insert a picture of the next favorite because it's stuck on pretty good and I don't wanna fight with it. They are the suction towel or robe hooks. They come in gold, silver, or a matte black. I have them in silver in my bathroom. I have one on the outside of my shower stall to hang a robe or a towel. I have it on the inside of my shower stall to hang my squeegee, my exfoliating mitts, things like that. You don't have to use them in the shower. You can suction cup them to any flat surface. They are fabulous, and I think they're prettier than a traditional hook style. Still on the top of the lifestyle picks is the art that I got for my Samsung Frame TV. Kind of reminds me of the inside of a geode for some reason. Getting some questions, I'll address it again, as how the Samsung Frame TV works. The whole point of the Samsung Frame TV and why it is so ridiculously expensive. One, it's completely flat and can be hung flush against the wall. And the cords, there are no cords. So it looks like art. It can display a static picture for forever and it won't ruin the screen. Unlike traditional flat screen TVs, it can't hold a static picture for very long or it'll burn the image into the screen. That is not the case with the Samsung Frame TV. So that's why it's so appealing. You can get it in various sizes and you can switch out the art at will. There's memberships you can join. You can download it from Etsy like I did. You can upload your own pictures of your family, whatever. You can have it show collages. It's pretty handy. 
And then number five, we're at the end, and something I love talking about is Quest Protein Powder. So I just bought it in the chocolate, and there's the front of it, and I'm using this in a coffee chocolate banana smoothie that I've really been enjoying. I'll include that recipe down in the description box. But my personal favorite and what I use more than chocolate is vanilla. I'm a vanilla girl, I love vanilla. What can I tell you? I love these both, one scoop per smoothie. And while I'm not currently on any sort of hardcore plan, like the faster way, I'm still doing intermittent fasting. I'm still keeping track of my portions and definitely incorporating smoothies more days than not. And so this is my protein powder of choice. They have tons of flavors. We also have peanut butter in the pantry. That is definitely Michael's. They have like a cinnamon. There's a lot of options, but I'm pretty basic. Chocolate, vanilla for me. So that was it for viewer favorites from June. I have a feeling that when we look back at July, there's gonna be a lot of things from Nordstrom on there. That's not up to me, that's up to you and however you choose to shop. So I cannot wait to see how those turn out. In the meantime, I hope you're having a lovely July. Thanks for hanging out with me again today. Make sure you're subscribed and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.